today let me adjust my volume back again get this right here that looks good okay what am I doing playing with the controller trailers pretty good what one is B there we go all right so Bork Bork Vash is here hello Vash how are you it's good to see you how is everyone tonight Thank you everyone for showing up. Snare, it's good to see you. We don't get to see each other near as much as I'd like. Geeky, Vallejo, Vash, happy to see every single one of you here today. You'll have to pardon me. I'm feeling a little bit under the weather, but we are doing our best. I did not want to put this off another day, so probably going to take our time. Might not get too excited or worked up, but uh, it's character creation day, which I think I forgot to put in my tags. Maybe I did. I set it up ahead of time because I thought I would forget, and I did, for sure. So, then, I'm used to playing on mouse and keyboard, so pardon me. I'm trying the controller. I think we were decided we were playing a Dalish. Y'all, oh, have a good night. Thanks for stopping in, at least. I can't use my D-pad, this is so weird. Mage. We'll play on normal. We are! It doesn't tell me what I am. It used to tell me, like, the title. Enslaved long ago by humans, most elves still live as second-class citizens within human cities. Elves who reject this life are known as the Dalish, nomadic wanderers who strive to keep the ancient elven religion and traditions alive. You grew up in the wilderness, a member of the Lavalon Dalish clan, and apprentice to its leader and guide, the Keeper. The clan wandered the northern free marches, and you had little need to interact with humans, until the Keeper sent you to the Chantry's conclave as a spy. What happened there, she said, would impact not only the Dalish, but indeed all elves. She could not have known how right she was. Yes, it's time! Psy-16, so good to see you! Yes, Geeky, we're playing a Dalish mage. One second, I'm just gonna set an alarm for myself to make sure I get enough sleep tonight. Just really quick. So I don't end up going long. Not that I think that'll happen, because I'm probably gonna get exhausted before that time, because I didn't really sleep last night. Alright. Let's get started. Yes, we want to import. I think the Dalish Mage makes the most sense. Um considering the storyline we have played so far. Yes. Cedric is going to cry because he's locked outside, poor baby. Hey, C. Colin. Thank you so much. Yeah, I just, that's one thing I didn't want to deal with tonight. But he's gonna scratch on the door the whole time. Poor baby. Ooh, we get to put gear on our characters again. Our party members. My mouse is just in the middle of the screen, why? I 
I have no idea what I want to make this character look like. Oh god, that's... I'm scared. <laughs> Like, I spent a bunch of time looking at names, but I spent no time thinking about what I wanted the character to look like or how I wanted her to behave. Which one do we start with? I don't know. They all look so weird to me. Wait, customize. Where's customization? Customize. Wait, which button is customize? There we go. Oh my gosh, Sadrito. Hello? You leave me no choice. This may not work. I might have to switch back to the keyboard. I don't know why this isn't working. Guys, don't fight. Come on now. Oi, gee. All right. Yes, we need to go back and fix this not working with our character. Goodbye, controller. Come on. No! I think I fucked myself here. keyboard okay here we go now we got it working <laughs> three hours of character creation yeah female elf mage normal Dalish apprentice there now that shows too I don't know why that didn't work I don't know, I think mine was kind of working a little wonky because I have a PS4 controller, so I was trying to use like a thing that would make it recognize, but it only recognizes like Xbox. So. A few hiccups. Maybe I'll have to abandon that or test it another time. You tried mouse and keyboard for 30 minutes and gave up? We're gonna start with this one. These are weird face shapes. Which one do I like? Maybe this one. These all look so weird. Oh, complexion changes everything. Holy shit. Kind of like the blushy way this looks. Was this what we had before? No, we had this one with like all the dots and shit. Okay. Eye color. Can we like zoom in more? Dark. Albino as fuck. No, that scares me. <laughs> yeah. It's freaky. I like the dark ribs around that. Whoa. And Ash just like went right through her face. Am I weird in that like blue eyes really scare me? I just, I don't get it, but they scare me. Those are very green. Hair. I'm really chilly. I'm gonna put my sweater on really quick. Please don't mind me. 
Hey, hi! Thank you so much for the follow, my dude! I have to readjust my chatty so I can see the alert. Yeah. Blue eyes are kind of weird to me, I don't know why. Alright, hair. Shaved head. Lots of shaped head options. This is cute. It's cute too. Hey! They were doing these cuts before it was popular, man. Wow, check that out. <laughs> you told all your supervisors to kiss your ass? You have Kate stream to watch? Aww. Welcome home, Ash. Hi, how are you doing? I'm going to take it a little slow tonight because I'm not feeling super hot. But we're going to get through it. I didn't want to push this back. No way. No how. Hey, Adela, how's it doing? Check that snowflake out. Where'd you get that? Direct Relief Charity 2018. That's cool. This haircut's super cute. I like it. That's ugly as fuck. That's also really cute. This is like Goblin King to me. Hey, thank you so much for the host size 16s. It's good to see you, my dude. Good to see you. A fucking cute nerd. Oh, thank you. <laughs> hey, Skrit. How's it going? Good to see you. So many of my friends here tonight. This is really exciting. It's making my day. Yay, thank you so much for the follow. Darren Dries, is that how you pronounce it, or do you pronounce it another way? You guys are all sweethearts. I spent all day being anxious. This feels pretty good so far. Long hair? Or more of a- oh, not that one. Or more of a bob. Hmm. Hmm. I'm kind of feeling the long hair. Hair color, though. Hair color. The only thing, I, the only other thing I'm worried about is if the light in this situation, because I had a friend before tell me that the light in this situation kind of seeps over, so they get soaked in this green light during character creation. I am not ready for the wild ride. I'm scared. I'm not. I'm not gonna lie. I'm a little scared. I'm excited, but I'm scared. Darren. Oh, Darren Dries. I missed the D there. Don Trey, thank you so much for the follow, my dude. Magic school bus, yeah, that's great. I did not think ahead to how I want to make this character, like, at all. <laughs> One person suggested I try and make her look like me, which I think is a really weird suggestion. But it's doable, I guess? I don't know how I feel about that, though. That's always really weird to me. I'm thirsty. I'm also hungry. I had a banana. Like, I don't know, I've been like fucking hungry all day. I was not hungry for the last several days, but now I'm just like, I want to eat everything. Neutral lighting. It does seem like there's a cold white light in the front, but I don't know. I've had another person say that um, the green in the background does kind of bleed. I don't like the pasty white. It's freaky. I also don't feel like playing- I don't know. I don't feel like playing an entirely white character. I feel like that's weird. I like the warm tone, though. Old. Freckled. Sun-touched. Hungry for DAI, it's true. I was looking forward to this for the last couple days like so much that I was just like, I couldn't think about anything else for like the last five days. And then I had to go and start feeling sick last night and I was like, no! So we're gonna take it slow. I wanted to be more hype. I wanted to be all the hype. But we're just gonna take it slow. Yeah, I had no sleep. 
<laughs> I got like maybe three hours of sleep. This is a really washed out blonde, but I kind of like it. But I also like this red, the dark red. I really like sort of auburn hair. I like it a lot. But. Hmm. Which one between this, this sort of, that's like what my hair color is at the tips? If the light is actually right? Here, you can have the white light here, you can see here. Because this is warm light over here. It's different. I don't know why. I think because of the ring light. No, I don't know why. <laughs> I love Eyeburn too. I'm really weird about making characters with white hair. Like, the only character I have with white hair is in Guild Wars 2. But she's a plant. Not that that's natural. What do you guys think? The lighter one or the darker one? I think I like the lighter one. And there's only me no choice. there's only two voices to choose from. As long as the job gets done, I don't care about the rest. As long as the job gets done, I don't care about the rest. You leave me no choice. That is commanding. I just hope I can help. Ooh, that's deep. Nah, let's go with the Everything the. Heard, completely true. Let's go with this one. Why not? I just hope I can help. Okay, head and ears. Ear size. What does this do? Ooh, that's big. Where does this move them? What does up and down do? I don't understand. Oh, is one of them like? One of them is how much they're. Okay, that's tilt and that's size. Okay. Cool, 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 ear position. This is weird. <laughs> I don't know. This strains me as an artist because I should know where to put the ears, but I don't. <laughs> ears be thick. I have those anime elf ears. Ears for days. I made a character with ears for days while I was practicing playing with the creator, and it actually looked good on like a guy character. But like... I'm only okay at making, like, somewhat okay-looking people. I'm not very good at making actually attractive-looking people. This background is, like, giving me vertigo for some reason. This is weird. Cheekbones. <clears throat> Maybe it's because I just feel so weak anyway. Lack of sleep and whatnot. Yeah, any change kind of makes them look wrong. Cheek shape. Ooh, okay. Not that thin, maybe. I really want to adjust the jaw, the jaw brow size. This is also important. Actually attractive, you mean from a constrained modern point of view, or what makes a person attractive? Like, I'm good at making characters that are like, maybe a 5 to a 7, but like, making a character that just really knocks it out of park, the like, 8 or 9, I, I am really bad at making just ridiculously attractive people. I'm usually like, hey yeah, they're kind of cute, I can see their head is like, put together, but like, the characters that are like, oh yeah, I'd bang them. Like, not good at that. Not good at that at all. Up and jaw, because the jaw is really bothering me. Jawline. Here we go. Turn that in a little bit. It's 
So we skipped some here. Eyes. Start with a character that I'm attracted to, and then the little sliders happen, and then they turn into something from Monster Factory. It's a curse. I hear you. These eyes are kind of tilted down, which is okay. It tends to make a person look apologetic. Those are even more tilted down. Squinty. Very squinty. Ooh, then some smoldery eyes right there. You're five, maybe someone else is ten. That's true. That's true. I think I might like these. The makeup is maybe putting me off, though. Eye size. What? What do these different sliders do? Okay. So width, width, and then openness. But her forehead is weird. Her nose bridge is also a little weird. Eyebrow style. She has no eyebrows. All right. We'll be here, size 16s. The eyebrows are a different color. Hello? Hello? Hello, where can I choose eyebrow color? What the fuck? What? What? Hello, Decranium, how are you doing? I don't like her eyelashes being pale either. That's just fucking weird to me. Outer iris color. Inner iris color. Let's tweak some more. Yes, that's hot. Okay. Game, please. Rectal exam, use both hands on my shoulders at all times. Cool. Cool. There's gotta be, here it is, eyelash color. No, eyelash color. Where's eyebrow color? I don't like pale eyelashes, it's weird. Get out. Those are still very light. They present very light. Huh. That's good. Yeah, Vash told me about the winter event. That is really cool. Didn't um, Guild Wars 2 give you kind of some problems with your arthritis and stuff, though? I mean, you're welcome to try if you like. But if it's going to hurt you, by all means, you know, do what's best for you, my dude. I don't understand.
Okay. We need some blush in here. This is just getting really pale looking. That's really bright, holy shit. That's not gonna work. That's not gonna work at all. The hell. Promise events. I hate that Christmas jump puzzle so much. Hmm, which face tattoo? Hmm. It's hard to decide. I do like this one, but I also like the one that's like under eyes. You know? Hey, thank you so much for the host shark RV. It's really bothering me that her eyebrows are a different color, and I wish I could change it. I wish I could change it. I'm so upset. Eyeshadow color. Yikes! Holy shit! Holy shit! How do you make up? Oh my god. Tuh. Turn that shit down. <laughs> Under eye color. Last time I did this, I end up just like trying to um, use colors that would kind of accentuate the features that she already has. Try the auburn hair instead. Yeah, maybe. Maybe. That doesn't really help now, does it? Eyeliner color. Eyelash color, eyeliner intensity, blush color. We did this. Lip color. Lip liner color. Black is the night when you are born. I remember Isla once saying that you pretty much have to turn the shine all the way down unless you want to be the shiniest lips in fucking Thetis. And I can't forget that. It always made me laugh. Hair. Hair color. The auburn hair looks really nice. Like, really, really nice. 
Yeah, I don't think there's anything I can do to make her her voice any less. Or um her eye Fuck. Her lip shine any less. I kinda almost feel like I wanna lean into it a little bit, honestly. God, I'm so scared for how monstrous she's gonna look. As long as the job gets done, I don't care. When we get her into the actual game. So scared. I actually kinda wanna lean into the shininess a little bit. Why the fuck not? Oh, her jaw is like receding. Holy shit. Okay. What is this? Okay. Jaw line? No, that's that's in the back. Chin size. What? Chin shape? Here we go. That's more like it. Adam's apple? No. No, 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 no. Jowls. Jowly jowlies. Lips thickness. <gasps> we didn't get to make her lips thick. <laughs> Uh, can I change this character? Gen thing imitated the crap out of me. Yeah. Hey JFWI, how you doing? Oh god. Oh god. I'm kind of a fan of these. Pouty. But at the same time, I like these. I would like to be able to, like... Wide mouth. I would like to be able to, like, change... The turn of her lip. Honestly. Why? Why did her chin recede again? There we go. Anything else we've missed? So we'll let's check the makeup. We can probably darken some of this up a little bit now. Under eye color. Hey, thank you so much for the subscription, Vash. It's good to see you. Hey, my jammies! I would love to have a comfy jammy stream. That's just what I should have done. Put my jammies on. Hey, Adela. Mystery of the receding chin, yeah? My fun! Oh lord, we just fucked it up. <laughs> this is kind of cute. Under brow color. This is what I want. I think this looks pretty okay. Jesus Christ. Eyeliner looks like shit if you do anything but absolute fucking black. Holy shit. Alright. What do you guys think? Is our Inquisitor ready to go? 
Subway Eat Fresh gift card? Oh my god. Are you serious? Are you fucking serious? <laughs> as long as the job gets done, I don't care about the rest. Yeah, I'm serious. I think I'm good. Oh shit, name, that's Roy. What name did we pick? Selena, Evunane, Evunane, Selena. I had like all of two options. Ready to go. I think I like Selena. Hello. Give me characters. Selena. He's absolutely serious. He narrated it. How did you pay for this with a Subway Eat Fresh card? I don't understand. How did that work? Oh god, her chin is so wide. You can pay for subs with a lot of different gift cards, really. What the hell happened here? Oh, sub. Got it. Tell me why we shouldn't kill you now. Because I know the nothing. The is destroyed. The fuck Everyone is going on? Everyone pretended is dead. Except for you. What? 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 Explain this. I can't. What do you mean, you can't? I don't know what that is, or how it got there. You're lying! We need her, Cassandra. I'm confused! I don't understand. Do you remember what happened? How this began? I remember... running. Things were chasing me, and then... A woman? A woman? She reached out to me, but then... Go to the forward camp, Lily Ameth. I will take her to the rift. What did happen? It... will be easier to show you. Oh god, guys, we look horrendous in the light.
We call it the Breach. It's a massive rift into the world of demons that grows larger with each passing hour. It's not the only such rift, just the largest. All were caused by the explosion at the Conclave. An explosion can do that? This one did. Unless we act, the Breach may grow until it swallows the world. I have all the DLCs, yes. Yeah, I just finished the other two games Each a couple weeks ago as well. Expands, your mark spreads, and it is killing you. It may be the key to stopping this, but there isn't much time. What? You think I'm guilty? You still think I did this? To myself? Not intentionally. Something clearly went wrong. And if I'm not responsible? Someone is. And you are our only suspect. You wish to prove your innocence? This is the only way. Do I have a choice? So I don't really have a choice about this. None of us has a choice. Cassandra disapproves. Painful glowy green green clamp in our hands. Cramp in our hands. They have decided your guilt. They need it. The people of Haven mourn our most holy, divine Justinia, head of the Chantry. The conclave was hers. It was a chance for peace between mages and Templars. She brought their leaders together. Now they are dead. We lash out like the sky, but we must think beyond ourselves, as she did. Until the breach is sealed. There will be a trial. I can promise no more. Come. It is not far. Where are you taking me? WASD to Your move and Q and E to straight. Something smaller than the breach. Why do my why are my arms out like this? You can also look around by holding right click and moving the mouse. While looking with the mouse, you can strafe with A and D. Oh god, okay. I need to change. Wait, no. I don't want to invert. Fuck. I want to invert this one. Or uninvert this one. Confirm changes back. Oh, no, no, no. We finished two, uh, two weeks ago. A eye on the map indicates my quest destination. Yeah, it's been a while since I saw you, NSC. How are you doing? Is Cassandra following me? She is, okay. March me off to the rift. are coming faster now. The larger the breach grows, the more rifts appear, the more demons we face. Been strange here too. The blast. They said you stepped out of a rift, then fell unconscious. They say a woman was in the rift behind you. No one knows who she was. Everything farther in the valley was laid waste. Ouch! Whoa! Well, stay behind me. We're an elf.
There we go. I was beginning to wonder if I had actually picked mage or if I had accidentally chosen rogue. The armor looked a little suspicious. Hold? What do we have here? Chain lightning and flash fire. It's over. Drop your weapon now. Ah. I don't need a stuff. All right, I'll disarm. Jesus Christ. All right, all right. All right. Have it your way. Wait. You don't need a staff, but you should have one. I cannot protect you. I should remember you did not attempt to run. Thank you. Press 9 to consume a potion and heal the controlled character. Potions. Make a knows what we will face. Where are all your soldiers? At the forward camp or fighting. We are on our own for now. How do I find loot? Which button shows me where loot is? What is what did that do? Oh, control pauses. I'm used to space. I wonder if we should change that. Oh, I can jump! Never mind. Never mind. Control is weird, though. Might have to change that up. Loot. Jumping! Whoop. I'm sorry, Cedric. Cannot. Plus magic defense, magic defense. Oh god, this hat looks so god-awful. Holy shit. Yeah, he's gonna cry, but I can't really handle him right now. Abilities consume mana and stamina for powerful combat effects. Most abilities require time to pass before reuse. There, watch out! If we flank them, we may Let gain me the pick advantage. it up. Tab to lock on your current target. Right click the ground to unlock. Lock on targets by clicking them. Two. Did I just not have enough mana? We might be okay. Loot! Gimme! No, let me pick it up. That's frustrating. Yeah, that might get annoying. <laughs> Picking up items almost needs to be like a different key. Yeah, please do. Give me uh, hints on controls. Yeah, it tries to pick up look. Accidentally hits an NPC and aggro's the whole town. Ah, they're falling from the bridge. Are they? Jeez. Cassandra, please. F you believe is also loot? That would be great if F is loot, because I will definitely use that. 
I accidentally opened up the console somehow. How did I do that? Shit. Fuck. Um. How did I do this? What did I do? Tildy. Fuck. Alright. Thank you. That is exactly what it was. <laughs> F is pay respects and loot. I keep thinking right, right click is attack, but it's not. Ow! Also be a we key to search. Them. V, I think. Oh hey. Hey, thank you so 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 much for the subscription, Adela. Sorry, I'm just like a little brain foggy today. Who is foe? yours. I did that? I closed that thing. How? Whatever magic opened the breach in the sky also placed that mark upon your hand. I theorized the mark might be able to close the rifts that have opened in the breach's wake. Yeah, after your life has gone. was correct. Meaning it could also close the breach itself. Possibly. It seems you hold the key to our salvation. Good to know. Here I thought we'd be ass deep in demons forever. Varric Tethras, rogue, storyteller, and occasionally unwelcome tag along. You're never unwelcome, Varric. Oh, Cassandra doesn't like you, does she? <laughs> <laughs> nice crossbow. That's a nice crossbow you have there. Ah, isn't she? Bianca and I have been through a lot together. You named your crossbow Bianca? Of course. And she'll be great company in the valley. Absolutely not. Your help is appreciated, Varric, but... Have you been in the valley lately, Seeker? Your soldiers aren't in control anymore. You need me. Ugh. My name is Solus, if there are to be introductions. I am pleased to see you still live. He means, I kept that mark from killing you while you slept. Aww. You know about it. You seem to know a great deal about it all. Like you, Solas is an apostate. Technically, all mages are now apostates, Cassandra. Oh? My travels have allowed me to learn much of the Fade. Far beyond the experience of any circle mage. I came to offer whatever help I can give with the breach. If it is not closed, we are all doomed, regardless of origin. And when this is over? And what will you do once this is over? One hopes those in power will remember who helped, and who did not. Cassandra, you should know. The magic involved here is unlike any I have seen. Your prisoner is a mage, but I find it difficult to imagine any mage having such power. Understood. We must get to the forward camp quickly. Well, Bianca's excited. It seems opinions on Solus are very split. 
This way. There Down might be the some people who show up in chat that hate him, but we must move quickly. I think a lot of people who are here currently like him. I can't be for certain. Oh no, Vash hates him. Oh my god, I just accidentally like tabbed out into the fucking chatty. All right, here we go. So is Promage 100%? What do you mean? Yes, F is loot, same as Guild Wars, fuck yes! Damn it, I keep clicking out of the window because I have bordered windowless on. <laughs> Acolyte Fire Staff. Is this better than what I have? Yes. Wait, there we go. It looks like a sickle. Isla loves him, from what I remember. Press space to jump over obstacles. Fantastic. Control with the party members use F1, 2, 3, or 4. They click their portraits. Demons ahead. Glad you brought me now, seeker. Tactical camera mode. Press T. To scan the battlefield. W, Q, S, E, or hold down right, left, or middle to scan the battlefield. Tab to cycle through targets. Right click to issue orders to move to a specific spot or attack a specific enemy. Okay. What else is out here? Jeez, why is it stuck to the ground? We go pan out. Nothing else? Alright, neato. What can my friends do? Shield wall, challenge, payback strike, barrier. Winter's Grasp, Varric, Longshot, Caltrops. What are Caltrops, precisely? Do I have to aim them? No, Varric, I don't want you to move to the lead. Uh, well, let's see what happens here. I'm gonna jump so many times! Oh my god, okay. Okay. Uh... What is this? What is this text? Um... Uh, I can't actually change... Key bindings, here we go. I want pause and unpause to be alt. Did that? This can be fuck. What do I usually sprint with? Press jump to jump. Walk toggle can be control. Voice chat? Fuck that. <laughs> Alright. Okay. Maybe this will be a little smoother now. Nope. I still have a learning curve. That is on cooldown. Yeah. You can attack this guy. I need to move. Fuck. Someone help. I'm so glad I can queue jumping. Did 
Did you just shield all of us? Fucking bless. I'm gonna press spacebar so many times trying to fucking pause the game. I am on normal difficulty. Maybe bind jump to ult and pause to space. Maybe. We'll see. We will see um, if this isn't just a bit of a learning curve first, though. Sometimes all you need is a little bit of patience. Jump less than I need to pause. Maybe. Maybe not. We will see. There's loot. Loot! Let me take it. Is there a quick save? Whoa, back. Clear commands is K. Quick heal, nine. Call mount, dismount. Quick save is F5, quick load F9. Needle burrito. I think we need to go up here. <laughs> Get you every time. Should have spun a story. That's what you would have done. It's more believable and less prone to result in premature execution. Fuck. Ah, oh my God. All right. Just attack it? Fuck. Ow. Press F? Press F. Hurry, use the mark. I did. Once all the demons spawned are dead. Once all the demons it has spawned are dead. Fuck. Accidentally attacked door. Door is locked. Fuck. Oh, it's still not closed? Are you serious? So I guess I just interrupted it. Did that weaken the demons? Character is leveled up. Well. The rift is gone. Open the gate. Right away, Lady Cassandra. We are clear for the moment. Well done. Whatever that thing on your hand is, it's useful. Press F to demolish hole. <laughs> How do I level up? Is it not gonna let me?
Click P. Thank you. <laughs> I don't remember it telling me. Call upon spirits for protection as well as the essence of the fate itself. Disrupt hostile magic, create defensive barriers, and even heal injuries. Chain lightning flash fire attributes. Magic? Did it like auto level me up? What's going on here? Yes, this is my Inquisition Cherry. Thank you. No spoilers, please. One point to spend. This is a passive. What is this? Circular icons. Okay. Look. What is this? Barrier. Flashpoint. Land a critical hit, your next spell cast doesn't trigger a cooldown period. We'll take that. Thank you. I always welcome controls tips, but I just don't want story spoiled. Damn it. Chancellor Roderick, this is... I know who she is. As Grand Chancellor of the Chantry, I hereby order you to take this criminal to Valroyo to face execution. Order me? You are a glorified clerk, a bureaucrat. And you are a thug, but a thug who supposedly serves the Chantry. We serve the most holy, Chancellor. As you well know. Justinia is dead! We must elect a replacement and obey her orders on the matter. Uh, so no one's in charge here. So none of you are actually in charge here. You killed everyone who was in charge! I what? Call a retreat, Seeker. Our position here is hopeless. We can stop this before it's too late. How? You won't survive long enough to reach the temple, even with all your soldiers. We must get to the temple. It's the quickest route. But not the safest. Our forces can charge as a distraction while we go through the mountains. We lost contact with an entire squad on that path. It's too risky. Listen to me. Abandon this now, before more lives are lost. How do you think we should proceed? What? You're asking my opinion? No, you're asking me what I think. You have the mark. And you are the one we must keep alive. Fuck. Since we cannot agree on our own. <sighs> I already forget what they said about each one. We'll take the mountains. Use the mountain path. Work together. You all know what's at stake. Liliana, bring everyone left in the valley. Everyone. On your head be the consequences, Seeker. Oh, if you hover over the tri it'll tell you about him again. That's good to know. Yeah, I saw that just as I hovered over it, but I clicked too quickly. Live and learn. All right. 
Here we go. The tunnel should be just ahead. The path through the temple lies just beyond it. What manner of tunnel is this? A mine? Part of an old mining complex. These mountains are full of such paths. And your missing soldiers are in there somewhere? Along with whatever has detained them. We shall see soon enough. Hmm. That doesn't sound curious at all. This thing is strong. I wonder if it'll let me jump off of the ledge. Not that that would be a wise decision. Is there anything in here? No. You can jump off ledges to your death. Good to know. Is that ice? It appears to be ice. Is ice slippery? Nope. Ice is not slippery. Did it once and lost like 20 minutes of gameplay? Oh no! Let's jump. Loot. I'm going to accidentally do that so many times. Live and learn, or die and learn in that case. Guess we found the soldiers. That cannot be all of them. So the others could be holed up ahead. Our priority must be the breach. Unless we seal it soon, no one is safe. I'm leaving that to our elven friend here. Seal the breach. So you can destroy it before it's done? No, you can't. You can just disrupt it. Lieutenant, you're alive. But then what? Just barely. Oh my god. It spawned more things? Slender men! No! Or is it gonna keep spawning things? Becoming quite proficient at this. Why, thank you. Let's hope it works on the big one. Thank the maker you finally arrived, Lady Cassandra. I don't think we could have held out much longer. Thank our prisoner, Lieutenant. She insisted we come this way. The prisoner? Then you. Well, it is worth the risk. It was worth saving you, if we could. Then you have my sincere gratitude. The way into the valley behind us is clear for the moment. Go while you still can. At once. Quickly, let's move! The path ahead appears to be clear of demons as well. Let's hurry before that changes. Loot? Loot. Down the ladder. 
That's the way to the temple. Ooh, new equipment. Fire resistance cowl. Is this it requires level six? I'm not level six yet. What about my party? Oh, switch this way. Long sword. You can equip a bow as well, really? Solus. You're good. You're good. No, not weapons. I want to see armor. Thank you. Uh, no, you're good. Varric. Nope. Bianca. I have a feeling that will never change. He will just always have Bianca. Cool. Most everyone can equip anything, really. Wait, ladder they said. Slidey, slidey. God, I hope this isn't the way I came and I'm going backwards. I get lost really easily. So, holes in the fade don't just accidentally happen, right? If enough magic is brought to bear, it is possible. But there are easier ways to make things explode. That is true. We will consider how this happened once the immediate danger is past. Temple of Sacred Ashes. What's left of it? I remember the Temple That's of Sacred Ashes. You walked out of the Fade, and our soldiers found you. They say a woman was in the rift behind you. No one knows who she was. Are we in Ferelden? Because didn't we go to the the Temple of Sacred Ashes in Ferelden as well? Yeah, I get lost really easily. Unfortunately. Templar helmet. Put this on, thank you. Now you look silly. Like the rest of us. Welcome to the Silly Hat Club. Take up positions around the temple. This is your chance to end this. Are you ready? Yes. I'll try. I'll try. But I don't know if I can reach that, much less close it. No. This rift was the first, and it is the key. Seal it, and perhaps we seal the breach. Then let's find a way down, and be careful. Now is the hour of our victory. Bring forth the sacrifice. Sacrifice? What are we hearing? At a guess, the person who created the breach. Sacrifice? You're not talking about me, are you? Because we gonna have a bad time. Do you know this stuff is Red Lyrium Seeker? I see it, Beric. But what's it doing here? 
Magic could have drawn on Lyrium beneath the temple, corrupted it. <sighs> it's evil. Whatever you do, don't touch it. Keep the sacrifice still. Is there someone down there? Help me. Oh shit. Oh shit. That is divine Justinia's voice. Is that me? That was your voice. Most holy called out to you, but what's going on here? Run when you can! Warn them! We have an intruder. Slay the elf. No. And the Divine, is she? Was this vision true? What are we seeing? I don't remember. Echoes of what happened here. The Fade bleeds into this place. This rift is not sealed, but it is closed. Albeit temporarily. I believe that with the Mark, the rift can be opened. And then sealed properly and safely. However, opening the rift will likely attract attention from the other side. That means demons! Stand ready! Hey, thank you so much for the host, Az. How are you doing tonight? we have here what do we have we just have a big old rift do we have any demons to fight oh yes we do a pride demon wait oh god we must strip this looks like big spiky boy internet keeps going up and down no no Inquisition is, um, we just started. I'm doing my best. Um, I don't feel a whole well myself, so we'll see. I might end early. I'm gonna try to go another 20 minutes. Wear it down? Fucking how? What do I need to do? How? Thank you so much, C. Colin. Quickly. F oh, disrupt the fade. I'm a dumb. All right. The rift. Thank. Well, how? I have to find a way up there, don't I? Fuck. How? How? Quickly, How? It seems to be too far away. Rip. Oh, here we go. The demon is vulnerable. Now. Jeez. 
shit. I keep thinking space is pause, like it was in the other ones, but it is not. Is the, is the rift closed again? No, it's not. Damn it. This is silly. Okay. You. you. Use your piercing arrow thing. No, it's on cooldown. All right, Cal drops it. You. That's on cooldown as well. Gosh darn it. It must just be immune to the, um, to the stun that the fire imposes. Well, fuck you, demons. I love the fact that I can... I can Q jump. Low health. This isn't good. Damn it. Cassandra, okay, good. She used a healing potion. NPCs, please, could you be helpful? We're gonna do so much jumping. <laughs> oh no, I'm dead. Oh, I can revive them, really. All right. You. You can also F revive. This is maybe not a good idea to play a mage when my Inquisitor is just not allowed to die because I have to disrupt these rifts. We are out of healing potions. God, let this be it. It dead? No. The rip. Oh, fuck. Alright, I gotta do that now? Do it. of heaven. Long load times on this game. Isn't there?
Those lips are really fucking shiny, holy shit. Oh! I didn't know you were awake, I swear. Why are you afraid? Why are you frightened? What happened? That's wrong, isn't it? I said the wrong thing. I don't think so. I beg your forgiveness and your blessing. I am but a humble servant. You are back in Haven, my lady. Haven? They say you saved us. The breach stopped growing, just like the mark on your hand. It's all anyone has talked about for the last three days. Then we're safe. Then the danger is over. The breach is still in the sky, but that's what they say. I'm certain Lady Cassandra would want to know you've wakened. She said, at once. And where is she? In the Chantry, with the Lord Chancellor. At once, she said. Okay. Help, Root! Vain hope. Someone better at this than me takes over before the survivor expires. Notes in case. Clammy, shallow breathing, pulse over fast. Not responsive, pupils dilated. Mage says her scarring mark is thrumming with unknown magic. Wish we could station a Templar in here, just in case. This picture has been in all three games. Delicious elf fruit not made with real elves. That's her. That's the Herald of Andra. Why are they all saluting me? Day three, less thrashing. Some response to stimulus. Vitals seem solid. Two attempts so far by locals to break into the Chantry to kill my patient. All this work to save her life, and will they just execute her? We'll inform Lady Cassandra I expect her to wake before the morn. Good luck sealing those rifts. Were they there before? Can't open that. Thren? Not taking orders right now. Got a problem with it? Bring it up with Cassandra. No, it's fine. I don't know who you are even. The Chancellor of Roderick says that the Chantry wants nothing to do with us. That was the Chancellor of Roderick's decision, The light shall lead her safely through the paths of this world and into the next. For she who trusts in the maker, fire is her water. As the moth sees light and goes towards flame, she should see fire and go towards light. The veil holds no uncertainty for her, and she will know no fear of death for the maker. Shall be her beacon and her shield, her foundation and her sword. Founding of the Trantry. Don't care about that necessarily right now. Trantry hierarchy. Yeah, Isla's, uh, Isla's emote is great. Can't open this. Sorry, prisoner. No luck for you today. I can light torches, though.
hot tea sounds nice. There was no word for heaven or for earth, for sea or sky. All that existed was silence. Then the voice of the maker rang out, the first word. And his word became all that might be, dream and idea, hope and fear, endless possibilities. And from it made his firstborn. And he said to them, in my image I forge you, to you I give dominion over all that exists. By your will may all things be done. Then in the center of heaven he called forth a city with towers of gold, streets with music for cobblestones, and banners which flew without wind. There he dwelled, waiting to see the wonders his children would create. The children of the Maker gathered before his golden throne and sang hymns of praise unending, but their songs were the songs of the cobblestones. They shone with the golden light, reflected from the Maker's throne. They held forth the banners that flew on their own. And the voice of the maker shook the fade, saying, In my image I have wrought my firstborn. You have been given dominion over all that exists. By your will all things are done, yet you do nothing. The realm I have given you is formless, ever-changing. And he knew he had wrought amiss. So the maker turned from his firstborn and took from the fade a measure of its living flesh and placed it apart from the spirits and spoke to it, saying, Here I decree opposition in all things, for earth, sky, for winter, summer, for darkness, light. By my will alone is balance sundered and the world given new life. And no longer was it formless, ever changing, but held fast, immutable, with words for heaven and for earth, sea and sky. And last did the maker from the living world make men, immutable as the substance of the earth, with souls made of dream and idea, hope and fear, endless possibilities. Then the maker said, To you, my second born, I grant this gift. In your heart shall burn an unquenchable flame all consuming and never satisfied. From the fade I crafted you, and to the fade you shall return, each night in dreams that you may always remember me. And then the maker sealed the gates of the golden city, and there he dwelled, waiting to see the wonders his children would create. Canticle of Threnodes 5 1 through 8. That is very similar to the Christian creation myth. Earl Grey. Children of Andraste. Don't care all too much. Nave? I believe Seeker Pentagas is looking for you. Oh. Was he? Please tell me if you find something. Chain her! I want her prepared for travel to the capital for trial. Disregard that and leave us. You walk a dangerous line, Seeker. The breach is stable, but it is still a threat. I will not ignore it. Did what I could. I did everything I could to close the breach. It almost killed me. It did kill me. Yet you live. A convenient result in so far as you're concerned. Have a care, Chancellor. The breach is not the only threat we face. Someone was behind the explosion at the Conclave. Someone most holy did not expect. Perhaps they died with the others, or have allies who yet live. I am a suspect? You, and many others. But not the prisoner. I heard the voices in the temple. The Divine called to her for help. So her survival, that thing on her hand, all a coincidence. Providence. The Maker sent her to us in our darkest hour. A chosen one? Are you serious? You sure? You really think your maker would send someone like me? The maker does as he wills. It is not for me to say. Even if that means a Dalish elf is his chosen. Humans are not the only people with an interest in the fate of the world. True. The breach remains. And your mark is still our only hope of closing it. This is not for you to decide. 
You know what this is, Chancellor. A writ from the Divine, granting us the authority to act. As of this moment, I declare the Inquisition reborn. We will close the breach, we will find those responsible, and we will restore order with or without your approval. What are we inquiring on? Literally slams the book this on is him. The Divine's directive. Rebuild the Inquisition of old. Find those who will stand against the chaos. We aren't ready. We have no leader, no numbers, and now no chantry support. But we have no choice. We must act now, with you at our side. Okay. Inquisition of old? What is the Inquisition of old, exactly? It preceded the chantry. People who banded together to restore order in a world gone mad. After, they laid down their banner and formed the Templar Order. But the Templars have lost their way. We need those who can do what must be done united under a single banner once more. What about the Chantry? We want a holy war. You're trying to start a holy war. We are already at war. You are already involved. Its mark is upon you. As to whether the war is holy, that depends on what we discover. Okay. It's a strange. When I woke up, I certainly didn't picture this outcome. Neither did we. Help us fix this before it's too late. She does have a rather girthy chin. Wonder how I didn't notice this. You can train crows to send messages. The chantry uses crows. Dragon Age Inquisition! And they put me behind a bush. Lovely. Lovely. Well, folks, I'd love to continue, but I don't feel well. Um, I need to go rest, so I'm going to save here and end early. Did that save? Yes, it did. Okay. I'm going to find someone that we can send you on to. Yes, this hat is dumb. And yes, my chin is girthy. We'll fix it eventually, I promise. Elves do love nature. Some of them do, at least. So, let me see who's online now, really quick. 
and what everyone's playing. Isla is also playing Inquisition, but this is not her first time. I'm going to send you over to her. Hang tight really quick while I get this all started. I don't have a window open. I must open a window. <gasps> so, those of you who are new here, we played all the way through Dragon Age Origins and Dragon Age 2 to get to this point. Um, I wish I could be more hyped for tonight, but unfortunately... Life is what it is. Hopefully I get better soon and I don't have to go to the doctor. Um, I will keep in touch. If you want to see my playthroughs blind through Origins and 2, they are all in the VOD tab underneath there. If you would like to follow for more, I play every Wednesday starting at 6 p.m. Central Time. You can hit that follow button right there. All of my socials are down below. I'm going to send you all on to Isla. Tell her how excited you are to see more Inquisition and you can talk about all the spoilers with her. I won't be there. Don't worry about spoiling it for me. I'm going to go rest. Thank you so much, everyone, for joining me tonight. It made my day. I'll see you next week. Mwah. Take care. You're awesome. Have a good night.